Hello everybody, this is Squeak from squeaknet.com and with this tutorial we want to show you how you can uh, uh, download games from our portal and then how you can play through those book or directly uh, running from uh, uh, your operating system uh, I, uh, in general Windows based um, from the home page you can uh, uh, reach every game you uh, want to download so we do divide the games in uh, genre so there are action games, strategy games, adventure, role-playing, simulation, sport racing and so on uh, in each of these sections you will be able to um, filter for a release date or tags uh, and uh, sort by popularity um, you can scroll the list of games, finding the one you, you would like to play again or you can use uh, the other facility we do provide such as browse so if you click on browse you will uh, be able uh, to see uh, another interface where we do recommend games for you based on the history you uh, have recently uh, done so the games you visited or if you already know which is the game you would like to play you can directly find it uh, through the our search engine so let's uh, look for Age of Empires that is one game we should be able to play uh, directly from uh, our Windows operating system since it's quite recent we do click here and uh, uh, what we will see is the um, game interface um, page so generally we do provide a video where you can uh, uh, see gameplay introduction and several other uh, things related to the um, game uh, you will find information you will find uh, uh, several reviews about the same game uh, of course uh, an image gallery and also some suggestion uh, if you want to play similar game to uh, the one that you're looking for so in this case Age of Empires um, let's open the page uh, we see that the, there will be a window showing up uh, the links that we do provide uh, where you we can see the status OK or demo or KO if the uh, resource is not available um, and uh, other information such as the language and if the uh, website we're linking to is going to ask you for uh, some sort of registration um, so let's choose uh, um, Age of Empire from Classicos Basicos that is a Spanish uh, partner that we have uh, a new little model window will open to uh, give to, to be to give you the ability to follow us so you can do it uh, in order to check out uh, our news uh, and finally you can go directly to the, the web page um, another important thing that I do recommend to you is that you will be able to go back to the list of downloads uh, in order to check out other resources if by any chance the one that you uh, have chosen is not working or has uh, broken links or uh, whatever issue it may have so you will be able to click as many links as we do propose from the page uh, you will have to look for the download link and uh, the goal of uh, checking a Spanish version is to uh, show you that uh, in this case the um, download link is represented by the word descargar that in Spanish means download uh, so it will be the same for other languages like French for instance uh, or any other that we do propose because not always we have the English version so we go here we have the RIP version that uh, it's a RAR archive that we will uh, see what it does mean we do save the file and uh, I already created a folder named games 
uh, and uh, I already download the game so basically I will skip but the idea is to download the game directly um, once we have done this uh, we will have to wait of course the download to finish so let's uh, pretend we are downloading the game uh, and we uh, go browsing for some other game um, so let's see what the recommendation give to us uh, or what we recently visit let's go with Doom, a classic uh, the structure of the page is more or less the same so finally you will be able to find uh, again the link um, if in some case we don't have the link it's because we there is no internet availability at the moment or for copyright issue or whatever so in that case we do suggest to uh, use Amazon uh, CD or DVD uh, we it's uh, likely with that we can propose it uh, or the digital distribution like GOG, Dotimo and the same Amazon where uh, in the case that is uh, possible to do um, so let's uh, go for Doom from uh, this uh, resource that this time is in English we do download we get the file it's okay and we do take another from another side so I can show you that in general there are differences that you should uh, every time understand so in this case let's search for the download here it is link I click again in many case uh, it's possible that in the website uh, we link to uh, you have to make a fourth navigation in order to find the final resource but in it's it should be quite easy and quite straightforward to do it so also here we do download save and this time Age of Empires should have done so I open the um, the folder. I have uh, several downloads that I did. Age of Empire was one, Doom, and also Duke Nukem. Uh, so when we have at this stage, we will have um, different kind of files. They possibly are uh, zip archive, rar archive. So what do we have to do is to decompress them. Uh, you should have already installed. Uh, uh, a tool to the compress where is uh, quite good otherwise you have to download and look for it so um, some software to be able to decompress in this case we uh, click with the second button of the mouse and we do decide to download uh, to the compress directly here automatically there are a folder structure and we will have a list of um, files that uh, we will have to uh, identify and then execute so in many case this is a Windows executable uh, uh, program so we have to find the application this should be uh, in general it's represented by an icon uh, or uh, it may be the case to run a setup so you either try the directly the uh, application or the setup uh, I do skip the uh, launch of the game uh, because the, otherwise the video is going to uh, skip but the idea is you double click here and uh, a new uh, full screen window is going to open and you will be able to play to the game uh, so let's go back to uh, Doom for instance and uh, we will have here a zip archive it's the same with the same tool or another tool you can extract the files we do extract in doom too. and here uh, since this is a DOS uh, application it's likely that if I double click uh, this is what uh, you're going to, uh, to, to see on your machine 
um, to be able to play this kind of games so let's say half of the games we do present and of course all the uh, games previous uh, of uh, 1996 you have to uh, run through those books so those boxes is another application will provide some tutorial for this too in order to show you how to uh, run and install so quickly I have already installed it in my machine I run it I have to mount the directory where the games are located in this case is the uh, games uh, in a let's see um, uh, virtual uh, uh, hard drive that is named C so here if I do dir that is a dos command I will see my list of directory and I will enter into the directory that has doom uh, is uh, already extracted so again here so doom and uh, once you're here and you have listed the files what you have to do is to uh, look for uh, again set up but most likely the executable that in this case is doom2 you run and we should be able to see our beloved games so here it is the main from them. Uh, of course then you can close and but this is uh, something that uh, uh, you will be able to check uh, directly on your own there are a lot of tutorials so we'll try to provide some new one for uh, uh, to show exactly how to install also those books uh, but the it's quite easy and uh, uh, for this reason we do recommend you to download all the games you liked in the past and uh, don't forget to like us uh, and to support us as usual bye bye